guys and welcome to painting with moo today we are going to paint ash asylum and i'm gonna change the brush uh so this game is literally you wake up in a uh, from i think you were you've been sleeping uh, so you wake up and then you realize you are locked in a room and you need to find your way out um so basically after that you you get out from your room and then you are basically running around oh shit i press space you're running around in, in like an asylum picking up stuff uh trying to grab them and find a use to be able to get through the front door and actually like escape um on top of that in this game you do have like glow sticks that helps you uh that helps you find items and you do have a little lighter which actually helps you keep like see lights you are supposed to have like a flashlight unfortunately i was never able to find that flashlight and all of these three light sources help you in this game. I think the lighter and the flashlight supposed to just literally give you some some vision. Meanwhile, the glow stick actually helps illuminate objects you can interact with that is useful for the story. For example, there might be some uh, documents that you need to read that has some good text, that has a code uh that you need to use to be able to open like a safe or something uh so like they're it's they have their uses for different things um but yeah so you you're basically it's a first person you're running around in this asylum you're trying to escape by interacting by finding stuff by picking up stuff at some at, at certain points you do trigger some changes in the asylum which means that you need to do something in order to trigger your progression, which means that you're getting stuck until you find out that trigger. Uh, and sometimes it, they, it doesn't really make sense. Like I had a hint asking me to light up all of the torches and I tried to and I couldn't progress. And then suddenly for some reason I just magically was able to uh which i don't know if i maybe found a torch that i hadn't lit up before that i lit up and then that triggered the door to open i i don't know it's just it's it's a little bit weird uh the, the game itself was not too great i think i i gave this game a three out of ten uh story cliche not very logical the enemies in this game is not very logical sometimes they help you sometimes they hurt you uh, you're supposedly have some kind of bad guy chasing you but there's no interaction with them and they don't help you or does anything with you really except for the damage you a little bit and then you take a painkiller and you're fine again it's just it just doesn't it's not make sense and it's it's a walking simulator you're walking you're picking up items you have a clunky really weird mechanics to use some of the items which is i really don't understand why it had to be that difficult uh but yeah so a three out of ten not very good it, it's the game itself i played much worse so there are worse games than this but it wasn't very good um it's also quite short which is good in a way because of the game quality not being really really satisfying so being a short game in this sense makes makes it easier and kind of erase the the kind of raise the grade a little bit but thank you so much for watching i do appreciate you i'll see you later bye